So the mainstream media wants to continue to try to label our president a racist. President Trump, he's going to go down as the greatest president of all time. The fact is, Democrats play the race card every chance they get because it's just down the bay. President Trump is not racist. President Trump's comments towards the quote-unquote squad were not racist. Facts are not racist. The media instantly said that that is racist, and nothing could be further from the truth. It's the tweet that's been heard around the world. Trump has brought in a record low black unemployment. Do not buy what the Democrats are selling. Wake up, people. We're running out of time. His tweets are hitting the heart of the problems in the Democrat city. He talking about people of color. Well, let me just tell you, as an American, and you can obviously see my pigment, I have nothing wrong whatsoever with what our president said. I agree with him. He needs to be going up on Mount Rushmore. He needs to come out with his own $10,000 bill with his face on it. Yeah. In the latest iteration of this, President Trump just called out Elijah Cummings because of how his city, Baltimore, has been run. If you don't like this country, if you like other nations much better, like Mexico, you can leave and let us have the country. What we saw with President Trump tweeting that Democratic congresswomen should go back to their countries, the media instantly said that that is racist and nothing could be further from the truth. When President Trump ran in the beginning, they called him a racist. When he won, they called him a racist. And let me tell you something, when he wins in 2020, they gonna call him a racist. Trump has brought in a record low black unemployment. Hmm, Trump, who has increased the black owned businesses. What was the heart behind President Trump's tweet? If you're going to be a part of the problem, then leave. If you do not like this country, you need to get on the first thing smoking and get the hell out of Dodge. You understand what I'm saying? This is real. It is because of President Trump. We're shining light on these s-hole cities throughout the nation. And of course, all of these s-hole cities are ran by Democrats. <laughs> No, he's not a racist. Was he a racist when he was hanging out with Snoop Dogg back in the day? Was he a racist when he was giving money to the Rainbow Coalition? Was he giving uh, a racist when he was hanging out with Al Sharpton? I find it quite interesting that people are calling the president a racist and, and acting as if the tweets that he's been tweeting lately, whether it's against the squad or whether it's against Elijah Cummings, that it's somehow a, a mysterious act of, 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 of bigotry and hatred. and It's, it's just foolery, man. People of color, color are so sensitive that they cannot take President Trump responding back to their ignorance and cannot take President Trump responding back to them forcefully that they need to leave Congress. A white man can no longer criticize a person of color. If you do, you're racist. <laughs> Because I guess people of color is always right. Always. <laughs> the Democrats don't want to respond with correcting the problem. All they want to do is just call everyone racist that do not agree with them. Mr. President, thank you so much for standing up for us, for standing up for Americans, and for speaking the truth and saying what so many of us really want to say, which is if you don't like it here, you can get the heck out. It's not racist to call out these facts. It's not racist to talk about terrible policy ideas of your political opposition. Democrats have been calling Republicans racist for years, despite the fact that they're actually the party of racism. The media cannot control me with the allegation of racism as it relates to Trump and what he said. So I'm tired of it. We the people are tired of it. America's tired of it. We need to come together. If Donald Trump is a racist, he's not very good at it. The Democrats are the party of the KKK. They are the ones that's racist. President Trump called it out, just like he'll call out anything. And the only card the left has to play is the race card, which is severely overplayed. I believe that the president of the United States, Donald Trump, is the greatest president to ever be in office. I think he's accomplishing what he's promised. And I think everybody should look at the facts. Thank you, President Trump. And I support 45. I support 45. I support 45. I stand with 45. I support 45. I support 45. And I support 45. I support 45. I still stand with 45. We stand behind 45. Yeah. I support 45.